All right, let's see if we can get the answer to this question. The poinsettia plant is indigenous to what country? 215263WMMR. I'm going to go to Mark uh, for the answer. Hey, Mark, how you doing? Good morning. If I win, will this be enough to spray Kathy's bush? Yes. <laughs> yes. It, it very well might be. Yeah, Please, Mark, fine. give us the right answer. Is it Mexico? Mexico. Oh. You can spray your poinsettia. You are correct, Mark. On your fact sheet, does it say where it came? the name came from? No. It derives its common English name from Joel Roberts Poinciette, who, the, who was the first United States minister to Mexico, and he introduced the plant to the United States in 1825. Okay. There you go. How about okay. that? And I was just curious how it became associated with Christmas and, and why. Maybe just because it's red and yeah. Santa Claus and I, I don't know. It's Jesus' favorite plant. Oh. Yeah. I had no idea. He he visited Mexico. He did. He did a little, little travel in his early years when he was still in college. Okay. Hey, is it true, though, about that it is not healthy for cats that it... Yes, that's, that's what the, I've heard. That yeah. It's not healthy for cats. Now, they supposedly created a, a hybrid version of the poinsettia. So if you want to take a crack at it and see if your cat will survive, <laughs> go for it. Wait a minute. In the United States and perhaps elsewhere, there is a common misconception that the poinsettia is highly toxic. The misconception was spread by a 1919 urban legend of a two-year-old child dying after consuming a poinsettia leaf. But that's a human child. What about cats? Uh, let's see. Toxicity is relatively mild. Its latex can cause an allergic reaction in sensitive individuals. So for um, 15 years, I didn't have a poinsettia in my house. <laughs> really, well, I, I could have. You know what? I don't know. It doesn't mention anything about uh, animals. animals. Oh, it says there, see cats deadly scourge of the feline world. <laughs> May sometimes cause diarrhea and vomiting. So nothing about kitties. Nothing about kitties in the uh, in this particular post. Well, why don't you just Nick just type in in the Google search bar "pussy" and see what comes up? <laughs> it's probably some sort of toxic, <laughs> toxic pussy. pussy. All okay. right, see what we get. All right, I oh, will, only 1995 a minute. I will move along. Get back to me if you find anything, uh, Nick. Um, Paula. Patton. Oh, yes. dude. What? I, what? I'm doing what Steve said. Take it off of oh. images. Man, right. just made oh. So he typed in toxic oh. pussy, but he had it on images. No, you don't want to I see that. Just... It's just, it's standard yeah. stuff. Go right. to videos. So Maybe now, there's cats. Now, now, now we know it's bad for your cat. Go to videos. Ew. Put up the videos. Oh, shopping. toxic pussy is a band. Oh, that's a good band name. Yeah. Yeah, it is. All right. Okay. What's your next story? Uh, Dan Rather announced a new social media page in the midst of January's flying fake news and alternative facts. The it's face- called Shart.com. <laughs> Shart. Shart.com. Okay. Now uh, join me over on Snapchat where I show you a sexy new way to work out. <laughs> I love your Dan Rather. <laughs> He said, uh, I got into this uh, into news in the first place to be a part of something noble and bigger than myself. Uh, for those reasons, I am starting a second Facebook page called News and Guts, a digital news feed of sorts. Uh, he said the goal is to inform, innovate, and inspire. He said this Facebook page will be under the stewardship of a very talented group of reporters who work at my company. These are men and women who know real news. Check it out at ToxicPussy.com. <laughs> <laughs> It was the only domain name available. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, shark.com is taken. Ah, son of a bitch. I know. They make that t-shirts. Sh- it actually should have been ours, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, they reported- always have great ideas years after other people have had them. He said, they've reported with me. <laughs> <laughs> Again, that's toxicpussy.com. <laughs> About cats. Yes. Right? Yeah. Uh, they've and re- their, uh, the reaction to poinsettias, yeah, which can be toxic and lethal, hence toxic pussy. <laughs> 